of July is peppered with picnics, pools, and parks, and that includes baseball. If you love grabbing a cold beer when you go to a game, you got to check this out. Every time you buy a large beer, you're paying $3 more for the same amount of beer. An Idaho couple uncovered the small and large beers at their local stadium were the same size. They took the stadium to task and won. So our investigative team went undercover to find out if you're getting what you pay for. Investigator Sarah Buddison is here tonight. So Sarah, we want to know, how did you test the beer? Danita, we took our measuring cup to ballparks around Northeast Ohio, and we bought every size for sale to make sure you're getting what you think you're buying. It's almost gone. Go buy me another one. For some fans, I have a nice, refreshing Budweiser. Beer is one of the best things about the ballpark. How many have you had today? Too many. And big brews are sold at stadiums for big bucks. You just drink them and hope it's what you paid for. Small beer is four dollars. Big beer is $7. You think you get more. Party and me. But earlier this year, there was outrage in Idaho when this YouTube video surfaced. A couple found the large beer at the Idaho Steelheads hockey game was the same size as the small. It's the same beer. $7. She just get a taller cup. So it's $14 altogether. So News Channel 5 investigators went undercover at ballparks around Northeast Ohio to make sure you're getting what you pay for when you buy beer. There you go. First up, Canal Park Stadium, where the Akron Rubber Ducks play ball. We tested the 16-ounce cup. That looks yeah, like looks it's dead on. on. Then the 32-ounce. Both were the size advertised. <laughs> Next, we went undercover in Avon at a Lake Erie Crushers game. We tested their 20 ounce beers, and after the foam evaporated, we found. Right on the money. Can I get one draft beer and one souvenir beer? On to East Lake, where we set up a spot to conduct our test at a Lake County Captains game. We poured the 20 ounce and 32 ounce beers into our measuring cup. Again, that looks like you're getting a little more. Both beers were a bit more than we paid for. The large beer is 24 ounces. Finally, we tested the tribe. Thank you so much and enjoy your game here. Thanks. Our producer was thrilled with our initial findings. That's 14. Mm -hmm. That's too extra for me. The 12 ounce was actually 14 ounces. No such luck on the bigger beer. It was exactly 24 ounces. I want an honest value and so do our fans. Kurt Schloss is the vice president of concessions for the Cleveland Indians. To have a 12 ounce beer, be a 12 ounce beer. To have a 16 ounce beer be a 16 ounce beer. I mean, that's that's the right thing to do, and that's what we should be doing. That's awesome. Very good. Very good. Our results makes the game good. We're a relief to fans. I'd be pretty upset. Probably wouldn't buy a beer. Eh, that's a lie. I'd probably buy a beer. <laughs> After that expose in Idaho, the stadium there immediately changed its cups. Thankfully, we don't have the same problem here. On your side, I'm investigator Sarah Buddison, News Channel 5.